Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe. Recent shootings have been caught on camera. Baltimore police releasing these pictures and videos of suspects seemingly knowing they're on camera when firing their weapons. Detectives are asking for the public's help to track them down. Now, despite videos available in some cases, the Baltimore Police Department's closure rate fell to just 36% last year. That means you have more than a 60% chance of getting away with murder in the city. Fox 45's Keith Daniels joins us live with a closer look at why Surround's video doesn't necessarily deter all criminals. Keith? Well, Mary, you've seen the images suspects caught on camera, but still tonight, some of them escape capture. The images can be disturbing. Surveillance footage of shooting suspects caught on camera. Bold criminals, some of them with no problem, looking directly into the lens. These newly released images of the suspects wanted in connection with the shooting deaths in the Upton neighborhood Saturday. Two victims, including 23-year-old Maya Morton, who police say was caught in the crossfire. Her two children, critically injured in the car crash as the mother tried to speed away. One of the suspects seen shooting his gun. The muzzle flash lights up. Suspects are aware of the cameras, but seemingly don't care. Dr. Christopher Herman. They've become accustomed to always being on camera. Is an associate professor at the John Jay College of Criminal Justice in New York. His thoughts on why some suspects may simply ignore the cameras when committing a crime. I think that this generation of shooters has just become accustomed to growing up under surveillance. But in a city where police have a dismal homicide clearance rate, there could be a more critical reason. By the end of 2022, Baltimore's homicide clearance rate had slid to 36.3%. That means that two out of every three killers last year have so far gotten away with murder and the clearance rate for non-fatal shootings even worse by the end of last year detectives had cleared 23.3 percent of non-fatal shootings that means three out of every four non-fatal shooting suspects have so far gotten away with it when shooters uh, shoot their guns and they don't get caught uh, they certainly grow more brazen uh, they certainly get more accustomed to uh, not being caught. And we know, you know, the research does show uh, the likelihood of being caught is the number one thing that deters criminals from doing crime. Herman says people intent on pulling a gun and using it have got to know we're in an age where cameras seem to be everywhere, including on people's front porch. This brazen homicide, recording from a resident's ring camera, a suspect seen skipping down an alley, then opening fire on a man in broad daylight. Shot 13 times. That deadly shooting happened in April 2021. So far, no arrest for that murder. Well, if you have any information about any of those crimes or others, you're asked to call police. Remember, you can remain anonymous and could be possibly eligible for a reward by calling Metro Crime Stoppers. Well, live tonight, Keith Daniels.
Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.